your doctor has prescribed Orgolutron. In this video, you will learn how to give yourself an injection of Orgolutron so that you can proceed with confidence. You should always use Orgolutron exactly the way your physician has told you. You should also read the instructions that are included with your Orgolutron injection. Of course, if you have any more questions about Orgolutron, write them down and ask your doctor or nurse during your next visit. Orgolutron 0.25 mg should be injected just under the skin once daily, starting on the day your doctor tells you to. Recombinant follicle stimulating hormone should be administered approximately at the same time, but the preparations should not be mixed and different injection sites are to be used. Orgolutron is supplied as a pre-filled syringe. Keep the syringe in its tray. It's important to store your Orgolutron pre-filled syringes properly. The Orgolutron syringe should always be stored in a safe place between 2 degrees centigrade and 30 degrees centigrade and out of the reach and sight of children. It should be stored in the original package in order to protect from light. Orgolutron should never be frozen. Do not use Orgolutron in the following situations. After the expiry date, which is stated on the label and outer carton after EXP. The expiry date refers to the last day of the indicated month. If it has been stored at a temperature greater than 30 degrees centigrade or less than 2 degrees centigrade. If you notice that the solution contains particles or is not clear. If you notice that the syringe or the needle is damaged. Do not mix Orgolutron with any other medicines. First, prepare for your injection by gathering all your supplies together. You will need one Orgolutron pre-filled syringe. You will also need some alcohol swabs or pads, sterile gauze and antibacterial soap. Always wash your hands thoroughly with antibacterial soap and water before you start. Now, you must choose the injection site and clean the area to prevent infection. Orgolutron should be injected slowly, just under the skin, preferably in the upper leg. Moisten a swab or piece of gauze with a disinfectant like alcohol and clean about 5 cm around the point where the needle will go in to remove any surface bacteria. Let the disinfectant dry for at least one minute before proceeding with your injection. Remove the needle cover by pulling it up. You may now discard the needle cover. Please remember to be careful with the needle at all times. You are now ready to give yourself an injection of Orgolutron. Pinch a large area of skin between your thumb and index finger. Insert the needle at the base of the pinched up skin at an angle of 45 degrees to the skin surface. Vary the injection site with each injection. Gently draw back the plunger to check if the needle is positioned correctly. Any blood drawn into the syringe means the needle tip has penetrated a blood vessel. If this happens, do not inject Orgolutron, but remove the syringe, cover the injection site with a swab containing disinfectant, and apply pressure. Bleeding should stop in a minute or two. Do not use this syringe and dispose of it properly. Start again with a new syringe. Once the needle has been correctly placed, depress the plunger slowly and steadily so the solution is correctly injected and the skin tissues are not damaged. Pull the syringe out quickly and apply pressure to the site with a swab containing disinfectant. Use the pre-filled syringe only once. When you are finished, dispose of your empty or used syringe and all waste in a safety container. An empty or unused syringe should not be disposed of via household waste. Please ask your pharmacist or physician how to dispose of medicines no longer required. These measures will help to protect the environment. You have now successfully completed the injection process for Orgolutron.